Hello everyone and welcome to the city. I'm here on my improvised helipad with of course my bell helicopter as you do. Today we're looking at MC Heli, one of the most awesome flying transport mods there are. Seriously, we're going to take a look at some amazing stuff during this showcase. Of course I'm sitting here in front of a pretty basic helicopter both in game and IRL. But don't worry, we're going to get into the really meaty stuff later. But first of all, let's go on a ride. Now you can see that the attention to detail is really quite good. And if we actually get inside and turn this thing on by just right clicking and we press F5, you can hear the awesome noises. You can see both rotors are spinning. Uh, we've got the down, the wind blowing down onto the onto our like wall helipad here. But uh, let's let's go. So let's get into first person mode. We just hit F5, of course, for that. And what we're going to do is we're just going to press W to go. And you can see at the uh, the bottom left over there my kind of throttle control that I'm kind of moving about. So if I slam it, I will increase uh, my altitude. And uh, next to that is the fuel gauge, which is reading empty right now, which is a bit worrying, but uh, not to worry, not to worry. I think that's because there's not actually any fuel in the copter, but I've got fuel in my inventory, so everything should be good. So uh, what we're going to do is we actually just use our mouse to control um, actual movement or our direction that we're going in. If we do want to like free look around, uh, as you can see in the screen, we can just hit left control and uh, I can actually move around without the helicopter turning. So let's just turn ourselves over here by uh, hitting left control again and moving back up to the improvised helipad. Here we go and up and up let's avoid this green building over here and we're just going to increase our altitude a little bit more and we're just going to stop oh it's all going wrong oh 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 don't worry we're all right people i'm just slightly crazy here we go and uh, we're just going to hit space to hover and we're just going to wait till we come to a standstill and we're going to move back a bit and we're just going to let ourselves drop. Uh, the helicopter has gone without me. That was a terrible, terrible uh, landing on my part. Look at that thing go. But don't worry, I'm very sorry. We'll do it much better next time. So, there was the bell. The bell is not the most interesting copter in the world. So let's take a look at some more hardcore stuff. Down here in the car park, uh, over here, we've got, uh, of course, some very, very cool helicopters. So over here, we've got a US military helicopter with a Japanese flag on it. Okay, I'm going to take that back and presume it's a Japanese uh, military helicopter. So this one here is the SH-60 Seahawk. And what we're going to do is we're just going to get in here. Now, let me just take you around this, for starters, and just show you the, the attention to detail that's been put into this thing. Uh, this mod was actually originally created by a Japanese man and he put it on a Japanese Minecraft forum and the issue was this mod is amazing but of course not a lot of people in the western world can read Japanese so uh, recently someone has actually just put the whole thing in English uh, he got permission from the author of course he got permission from Curse to put it on CurseForge and uh, that is how I found it now look at this you can see the computers in there you can actually get into the different seats you can see here I'm actually controlling this turret and I can I can really tear up mobs with this thing, it's unbelievable. Uh, here, over here is the computer system, uh, and then we've got the kind of, I guess, passenger seat over here. Uh, and then let's just go over to the pilot seat itself. What is this? I have no idea. So uh, let's just dismount and let's get into the actual pilot seat. There we go, and you can see that again we've got our turning rotors. Now, let's fly this baby. So what we, uh, we're we going to do is we're just going to uh, hit space to increase our... Uh, to set ourselves into hover mode. And then we're going to press W. And in fact, actually, we don't want to go into hover mode. We're just going to increase our altitude. Uh, we're going to let go of the mouse completely. We're just going to hit W so that we rise and rise and rise. There we go. And uh, let's let's do a nice and low uh, manoeuvre here. Now, as you can see, it's actually quite realistic. What happens is is I will uh, hover until I actually move my mouse so that the helicopter uh, faces forward. 
just like a real helicopter would. Uh, and it's really fantastic. Let's go over to, we've got the railway station down there. Uh, we've got what looks like a church over there. Now, if you have a look at all these controls, uh, we can see that we've actually uh, got a gun mode. And we can uh, fire missiles into buildings. How awesome is that? Uh, let's fire something into this building here. Boom. And smash. Oh my god. It's, it's just so awesome. We're going to press H to go back into helicopter mode. Uh, what we can do is if we want to actually use the gun mode and we don't want the helicopters to go anywhere, uh, what we can do is we can hit space to enter hover mode. So we will maintain our altitude. And then we can just kind of steady ourselves. So now what we're going to do is we can actually fire some missiles by just pressing X. And we can actually switch through our different uh, weapons. You can see I just shot a Hellfire missile directly at the church. I'm sorry, everyone. We've also got flares. We can hit V. And if we go into F5, you can see that we've actually been dropping flares all over the place. Look at that. And now, uh, let's actually go ahead. Let's get out of hover mode. And uh, let's land. Where shall we land? Hmm. That grass area looks adequate. Here we go. Let's just maneuver down. We'll just move our helicopter up. Oh, we want a little bit more altitude. And then we want to stop right there. And boom. I'm going to hit left shift to come down. And there we go. There was the, the, uh, the Seahawk. Now we actually do have some more helicopters. Let's go over back to our car park lot and take a look at the others. So over here we have the MH60L DAP, very fancy name, with its uh, dual turrets, insane cargo thing over here, uh, and of course some very intricate pilot controls. Let's get into the main seat here. Look at all of this. Doesn't this look fantastic? And the, the same goes for, for all of these helicopters generally. We've actually got some more. Uh, we've got over here, we've got the MI-24V Hind. Uh, I hope that's how you pronounce it. And you can just see that every last attention to detail uh, has been put into this. It's really, really good. We've got the MI-28N Havoc over here. And that is like the most, you know, the typical extreme military helicopter. Let's get into the, uh, the pilot seat, the cockpit of this one. This is the gun turret, I believe. Yep, yep, that's definitely the gun turret. And the pilot seat is over here. And you can see that I've got these active controls. Every every helicopter is slightly different in terms of controls. Um, the sound is the same, which, well, is not really that much of an issue because a lot of helicopters do sound the same. Uh, I'm not saying that in terms of real life, but I'm just saying in terms of, you know, this game. And you can see that those rotors over there were moving um, opposite to each other just like the real craft itself it's amazing how much detail has been put into this so that's it for helicopters do we have any more let's have a look at all these we've got a load of stuff here we've got a load of helicopters and mc heli is not just limited to helicopters we've got aircraft in terms of actual planes we've got that thing over there which we're going to be covering very soon uh which you might have seen when i've been flying around uh we've got vtols we've got actual vtols um, which we will also be taking a look at. We've got Cessnas, of course, you know, the little aircraft. And, uh, yeah, stay tuned. If you want to see more of these uh, plane showcases, uh, be sure to subscribe, because I'll be doing them uh, over the next few days quite a lot. Uh, and that is it. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that like button to leave a bit of support. Thank you very much for watching again, and I will see you next time.